This video is not for the sensitive hoes. The ones who can't take anyone else's opinions except for their own. If you can't have a mature conversation, then darling, this video is not for you. You will be blocked immediately. Now remember to keep it cute, keep it mute, or get the boot. Now preparing to nanny port to Nina's raw view in 3, A2, A1. Ooh, keep your funky in my face. I kind of like the smell. My name's Pierre Dees. Tamisha Iman's network changed my life. Don't I look sexy? Don't I look sexy? Don't I look sexy? Don't I look? Look at my body. Look at my body. Look at my body. Look at my. Don't I look sexy? Don't I look sexy? Don't I look sexy? Don't I look sexy? Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, 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 Gemini. <laughs> it's me, Black James Mansfield. <laughs> and it's time for All Stars 8. <laughs> Raw view. <laughs> Hello, you bald headed gizzards. I thought I would not be seeing you dusty, crunchy, munchkin holes until the season premiered. But today. But. Today, I guess, is the cast reveal. And, yeah, cast reveal. And I think they released the first 15 minutes. And I'm kind of excited for this season because it's kind of the busted season. We got James Mansfield. We got Naisha um, Lopez Dupree. We got um, the girl who wore bags. <laughs> I'm playing, but I kind of call this season the Misfit season. It's like the Misfit Girls. <laughs> but this is like an all-stars, um, almost like an all-stars seven, right? With, what was it, six with Sonique and them. Like the girls that we haven't seen in a while for a little bit. So I hope we kind of have that same kind of like feel to it. But you know, I'm excited to see some of the girls on there. So this should be fun. Oh, but I need all of us, everybody out there, my friends. All of my fans and haters that watch, we need to put on our best acting skills. What I like to do, what I like to do to prepare to get into some of my award-winning roles, um, is take a deep breath. <gasps> take a deep breath. <gasps> let's let's practice vocal exercise. Mama told me not to look for dad at night when she's at work and when he comes and touch me in the bed. Mama told me not to look for dad when she's at work and when he comes and then he touch me in the bed. And then you want to do some eye, some eye skills. Okay. Because we have to all act like we didn't know who was on cast. I smell an Oscar for all of us this season. <laughs> We're acting. I'm acting. So, okay, you know I have to... I'm gonna read a, read a few little things, not much. I'm gonna do tips and all that when the season starts, right? But if y'all would like to tip, please do. Tipping is not a what? A country in China, okay? So yeah, support me. Give me your money, okay? Why pay your rent when you can help me? Duh. So remember when that person wrote me a nice poem? Okay, so it made somebody get jealous. And all of a sudden, they want to write me a poem so they can try to outdo that person. Only they didn't slay as hard. But I'm still going to read their poem. They tried. Oh, my poor thing. They labeled the poem Sue Me, but didn't know how to spell Sue. They put S-E-W, So Me. Her name's Quirious. Patty, you know the girl that always send me, like, Philippine food? Mm-hmm. Just stick with that. Patty is great, 
is your trademark leaving an impact in every arc <laughs> a cute peach a sexy mouse a beautiful clown name it and he will always be the talk of the town because <laughs> he is pierre aka nina bonina brown <laughs> it's late it's the start of something new real piggies know those words from you <laughs> Come on, Dr. Seuss. Tipping is not a country from China, says Raw View. Keep your, keeping your opinion cute or just be mute so you don't get the boot and forever have a show. Dark humor is your type of play and fun. Throwing fluffball cocoa out of the window is one. Reading the tips and reading your beloved fans. We deserve the dragon, but ready to throw hands. <laughs> when your name is involved from hogs, aka drag race fans, Nina Bonina Brown is live. <laughs> the notification we need. Gaming, grocery shopping, wings and fries to eat. Fans have no idea if you're doing Zumba or creating a character in front of the camera. What? But one thing for sure, you're always you, Nina. <laughs> Thank you. I will always cherish this. Random. Do y'all remember a place called Fud Ruckers? I just brought that up because I was going to YouTube and they had a video, The Decline of Fud Ruckers. I forgot about, I never went to Fud Ruckers, but I remember that name. You know, they should have been closed for that damn name, Fud Ruckers. It, like, it really sounded like a curse word. <laughs> oh, we were watching some, going back down memory lane the other day, listening to a bunch of 90s music and stuff and looking at 702. I think I said it before, but... I'm telling y'all, one the singer Irish from 702, the one who was like the skinnier one, she was the hype man, really pretty girl. I swear, if she looked like how she looked then, her and Holly Bailey could be sisters. And she should have been Ariel. Tell me I'm wrong. Hmm. Well, let's get to it then so we can support these girls. And you know, there's one in particular that I'm really ready to support. I think you know the one. I thought there were two more things I wanted to talk about just really quick. So people were randomly, like, you know, the other day, or, or like, you know, I went live with Mistress. No, sorry, it was Eureka, Simone, and Suki Nutmeg Ganache. Um, <laughs> JK, girls. It was M Mistress, Lux, and Malaysia. It was a fun live video. It really was. It was like, Oh, these girls actually know that I'm not a messy queen. Especially Lux. I was like, oh, the prize Lux was there. But anyway, people were randomly bringing up um, T.S. Madison for some reason. I guess they were asking her. I, I, I mean, I don't know what's going on. They were like, why don't you like, why don't you like T.S. Madison? I'm like, what? I'm like, these fans are so bored, always trying to come and start some mess. I'm like, what? And then like, then I had my people, they were going to watch some video where I guess she brought me up. And I guess she, I never watched, but she, she said something like, I don't like her or because she once said that my padding was like, you know, the ghetto girl, like ghetto girl padding. I'm like, I never knew she even said that too. I don't care. <laughs> what would be the reason for me not to like her? Like what? The only thing I know is like a long time ago, when T.S. Madison had that show on WOW where she would drive people around and speak to them, they had wanted me to work with them, but then I never heard from them again after that. And this was years ago. So in my mind, I'm like, she must not like me. <laughs> Y'all never see me on her show, Queen's Court and stuff like that. So, I mean, I don't know, but I'm like, what? I'm like, why would I not like T.S. Madison? Like what? And especially not to like her because she says my padding to her is like a ghetto girl padding. Like, Okay. <laughs> anyway, I thought that was dumb. Somebody said that Wadala's next excuse is her pet llama kicked her and broke her knee while she was trying to vacuum her wall. <laughs> it was the vacuum in the wall for me. <laughs> ay, 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 Pierre. I can't come this time. I was vacuuming my walls. <laughs> This is how I know this is going to be an awesome season already. They're starting with bathhouse music. Ugh. Somebody get the poppers and get my prep milkshake. I'm going in. 
I don't know who this is yet, but I'm mad because I still have not done my Oblinga, Oblima, Oblima from All Real Monsters look yet. And here this hoga. <laughs> Everybody want to be different so bad. Oh. But if I had to guess who this is by the knock kneed legs and suspicious padding. Who is this? I don't know. I mean, I know I'm going to press play, but I'm just trying to judge by the legs. Caramel African-American leg. <gasps> Raven! How the hell is that candy, bitch? And she's skinny. Really? 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 <laughs> I swear, my people that watch my Twitch, pray for them. They get paychecks. Oh, you know why they get checks. That was cute. Now, what's gapping? <laughs> I can't. Okay, the outfit is kind of like basic without like the lipstick thing, right? But overall, I appreciate this like this opening. I really do. Like, I'm going to actually. I'm not that crazy over the outfit, but I'm still going to buy it because I just like I like the whole presentation. That was cute. Natural lips, honey. Yes. Yeah. You know, when you're blessed. She looks better though. She does. I mean, she, lo she looks better <laughs> than she did in her season. You're hearing me. I heard some drama about her in this season, but we'll see if it's true. How did Drag Race know I needed an edumacation? Oh, she's still alive. How? <laughs> I don't like this look. And I think only because maybe it needs to be more cinched. It needs a little more life or something. But I'm just happy to see Kasha. I have no beef with Kasha. Kasha has spoken with me maybe like, you know, a few times. Like we like actually like communicated, went live and stuff, whatever. So she's really a cool person. So it's good to see her. Like I said, I'm happy to see these girls who we haven't seen in a while. So, and they need more older queens on here. Davis, international celebrity housewife. <laughs> oh, come on, white egghead RuPaul. He looks kind of the same though. Like for so, like his guy, like he looks the same he did like those years ago. <laughs> and they said white people cracked. Oh, oh girl, bye, girl. Girl, no shade. And I, and this is not even because like RB for whatever the case is. This is really butch. I literally just see a pretty man. I'm not, I'm not even trying to be funny. I just see a pretty man. I don't, <laughs> I don't like this. You know, if for somebody that, you know, talks a whole lot of talk and swears by it, they are everything since pudding pie. This is not cute. And I'm not even, like, once again, this, this, this is not even, like, because, like, our little beef. Because y'all know, even if I don't care for somebody, I will still give props where props are due. But, um, yeah. No. But I do like the handcuffs. Your ringleader has arrived. Girl, Kahana made sure she was ready. Girl, she went and got, to, she went to Mexico and came back with her body, her face, everything. <laughs> she looks good. But I, I mean, but you know, but that's what, that's what good money does for your mama. When you, because her, for real, her, Coco and Alexis, they go to Mexico, get their work done. Because I mean, I was invited to go one time. Girl, I should have went. <laughs> Yes, ma'am. Now, this is a redemption, okay? Season 11, your girl has a glow up. I just secretly, some people think that she's on her way to being like, I'm trans. <laughs> but I don't know. She's giving me, like, you know, the Trinity Taylors, the people, the guys. Maybe at one point they could have thought about it, but, like, there's a lot of guys who 
they don't want to be trans necessarily, but they'll get their body done in certain ways so that when they do drag, it like they don't have to do as much padding and all that kind of stuff, you know. But yeah, no, she looks she looks different, a little little different as a guy. <laughs> But okay, look, I'm look. Give me some money and give me a good um per person who can do Botox and fillers and all that. Girl, I would not. I would. I would do it. Yeah, like like a carrier. Yeah, a carrier. But I think a carrier was at one point wanting to do trans or be trans, but then she kind of changed her mind. Which is like a little baby. Why well, I thought that was Evie Ollie just for <laughs> that blonde wig. <laughs> oh my God! What a glow up for real. <laughs> My nose done, my ass, my hip, my teeth done. <laughs> the news is back. Oh Lord. And I really mean the oh Lord. <laughs> oh, here we go. Well, it's over. <laughs> but as far as the look, I'll rip the look. You think I'm sexy? Nothing, you're sexy. <laughs> Ew. Wait, I wonder, like, is it just because this is, like, just a YouTube thing? Because, like, they are they really aren't showing the girls long at all. Like, you know, on, on normal, normal seasons, like, they kind of speak for a little more. They get right to the next girl <laughs> quickly. The wait is over. Well, the wait is still there. Big girl walking down that dirty street, putting on her funky feet. If it is a Darien Lake. <laughs> Now it is. Now I hate these dang Dorothy Hills from from the Wiz, but <laughs> the dress is really basic. But you know why I kind of like it? Cause it just puts me back in the mind of like on their season when it was just like you didn't have to have all these grand designers. You just go to Marshalls, TJ Maxx had a sale, J C Penney's outlet, and get you a nice dress and put it on, like. I live for it. <laughs> so I'm going to rent the look because like it's it's giving me flashbacks of like those days. Uh, and I'm like, okay. Black. Hold on. Make, make a phone call real quick. 1-800. I have paper on my mind. <clears throat> Hello? A line? Why the hell you didn't tell me you was on goddamn All Stars? And that you were now doing fishy looks? That is not how you... He Hello? Hel I know he did not hang up on me. Girl. Not the Boy Scout look. <laughs> or the Girl Scout look. <laughs> okay, Monica looks cute here. I'm gonna rent this look, Mama. Anybody else prepared for? Okay, giving us fish up in the um confessionals. <laughs> oh God! Everybody, pull out your hearing aids. It's time for James Mansfield. <laughs> wow, what a difference! But she's still wearing them dang payless bogo heels, them dang flats. Urgent news, quick everybody. I was simply t texting my sister. You can't see the text above, um, James, to, to congrats him on making it on All Stars. And I was saying I love his heels from Payless, very respectful. And then she posted that picture and said that comment. I don't think she should be Miss Congeniality for All Stars 8. Y'all must protect me at all costs. Girl, she swore she turned the party. Mama, the difference is, girl, I didn't wear those heels on Drag Race, darling. Oh, she tried my life. What a difference from when she first came in. <laughs> Hi, shapeshifters. What a difference. Okay, and they let her come in a little later. Okay. You see what happened when you sell your soul to Drag Race and RuPaul? They'll treat you better. Girl, she look good. Yes, ma'am. And, and how proud is she to be wearing her own wigs that she styled? Okay. 
I'm gonna buy this look minus the heels. <laughs> you kind of like I can see Miss Piggy wearing this secretly. Served a comedy queen. Season nine. With but in the confessional, Jane's giving me somebody's drunk Mexican uncle. <laughs> Holy sh! The way I've evolved from where I was in season nine. She seems more confident. She's acting. I know. Oh God. Alexis Michelle. Your last name. It rhymes with hell. You gave Shay Kool Aid that roll that day. <laughs> oh, it's a demon. That was it. <laughs> You're a demon. You're a demon. You knew I should have been Black China. <laughs> I do like this um this dress though. I don't know like the whole look together, but I do like the dress. I think it's sexy. She cinched really good. <laughs> Maybe some fishnets could have helped too, like some sexy fishnets. I can't. It's almost like I'm watching season nine again. <laughs> he looks the same like he did on the thing. Kind of giving me like if Forrest Gump put on a little weight. Also <laughs> like She just still sounds so like serious and fool of herself though. <laughs> it's like, okay, I hope she's more laid back this time more fun. I hope. Oh, that guy right there on the right. The right, his breath stanked. <laughs> and I'm not even kidding, his breath stank. I had told this story a story a long time ago that one of the pick crew members' breath stank, it was him. Girl. We were taking them pictures. I was like, oh. So just to let you know that if guys seem hot. Their breath is probably hot too. Just saying. Oh my god! Oh. Dang, they going crazy. Oh, that's Jessica Wild. Wow, she looks. I, I'm like, I'm like, is that is that, um, what's her name? Um, with the Muppet, the Muppet breast, Yara. Yeah, like, I feel like Yara would wear this secretly. I feel like it's something that she would wear. You know what's weird? I kind of want it to be cinch more. <laughs> or something like a little like it should have had like a little like flower belt, orange flowers in the middle. It's like some, something in the middle. I want something in the middle. Because like it's, it's good but then it's kind of like cheesy in a way. I'm going to rent this though. I'm like, yes, Jessica. She said, she said, honey, I'm coming back and y'all will know who I am. Okay. Yeah, this season for me, minus no shade, but like seeing like, you know, Candy or Nation them only because like they they've had so much shine already. Well, especially Candy, you know, and I, I, but like seeing some of these girls who like we just not have seen in a while. I'm like, yay! It brings back old times, old Drag Race. Only now with the current shenanigans and bull. <laughs> Jessica looks the same. Oh my god. <laughs> The girls are not aging. Or is it the studio light? <laughs> God dang, she was right on the D like cranberries. <laughs> Somebody said, do, you, do I think they brought her back because of the lip sync with, against on All Stars? I mean, I'm quite sure they were probably testing her when they had her in that other season of All Stars as a lip sync assassin. Welcome to another fry pot. <laughs> Oh my God, season two, wow, wow. She has not been on, besides that All-Stars thing, she has not been on a season since season two. This is what we need though. We need the girls from these past seasons. Oh, I didn't come oh. <laughs> ew. <laughs> I'm surprised they didn't really allow her to come out here like this. <laughs> it's the sandals. <laughs> and this is exactly how white people be sometimes, girl. All pale, wearing Jesus sandals. I hate it. <laughs> I'm going to buy this just for the foolery because it's so stank. It's so unnecessary. <laughs> you don't like Jimbo? I... I was liking Jimbo until they really started kind of overdoing her and overusing her. And I'm like, I don't want that for her. I don't want her to be overused, right? But, you know, she can't help it if they want to overuse her. I just hope that she kind of keeps 
who she is throughout the process. Did your mother smell my goddamn fingers? <laughs> Dang, how many queens did Joan Rivers? <laughs> Go what in the Mexican superhero? <laughs> this is cu like cute, but I don't. <laughs> I don't know, girl. Shaquille O'Neal is back, y'all. Okay, I'm gonna rent this. <laughs> I'm gonna rent the look. It's just like I don't know. It's something. Like, I kind of want that on somebody else. I can see Jessica Wild wearing this or something. What kind of stink music? Here at the All Stars, and what kind of abrupt cutoff of the of the, of the first minute? <laughs> uh, oh, you don't have pictures, you don't videos. It's an early day, everyone gets into their looks. It's right, they're moving so fast, I can't even like talk about anybody's looks. <laughs> like cats, really. The Ow, I mean, I'm sure they're gonna show them all, but yes, Darian. I wonder if James made that wig, or is it a wig by Vanity? Absolutely stunning. We're Nation does look nice there. 17 years after the competition. The blonde wigs are not working for anybody on here. <laughs> the color. This time, it's a brand new day. Ow, you saw the body. You seen it. Visually, the way. It's so weird seeing Alexis and blonde here. <laughs> I don't know if I like it really. It's just weird seeing it, but it is a nice wig though. And you know, we got some cute looks. Ow, but she looks pretty though. That dress, yes ma'am. Okay, look, I give a massage look. I like how the theme is old Hollywood. Oh, I didn't even realize that was a ponytail. I thought she just had like a big, like random fluffy flower on her chest. <laughs> but this is not giving me old Hollywood though. But I mean, but I like, I like the outfit though. The style and glamour has really. Ow, oh, look at Darian looking cinched and fine. Gone through the crown, drag as ever. Ay, ay, ay. Are those hooters or are you happy to see? me competition you want to win against the best of the best right so <laughs> why would they show that <laughs> all the people out there do not stop like i live for that wig miss kasha and i cannot wait to show you all i feel like the look that james had on when she walked in would have been better for this old hollywood theme because right now i'm literally getting james from season nine <laughs> Like no, like not like you know. Look, she looks more, you know, much more polished. But uh, this literally could have been like season nine, James, right here. <laughs> for the fantasy, the Lala Reese Spears. Lala still, like she got on makeup, but then I, I, I still don't see it. <laughs> oh, it's always exciting being in the same room. Girl, this is really. She looks scary, but I like this look though. <laughs> I performed with Miley Cyrus at the MTV Video Music Awards. I and so did the other queens. <laughs> I threw the first pitch at a socks game and I got to work with the one and only And I read Nina Molina Brown every week at Roscoe's. Oh, check out our Roscoe's video. Shout out Roscoe. But I've also gone back to my original love of acting with commercial. Oh, thank God she didn't say singing. Oof. <laughs> G. Alexi Brown to Miss Cornbread and also my Golden Boot Awards to Maddie Morphe. Now what, now, what you been doing since your time on Drag Race, what, your fame? I gave somebody a golden boot. <laughs> and I'm gonna prove that on this season. Well, from the rumors, you sure about that? <laughs> I can give my season 11 self some advice. <laughs> Lead a yellow wig at home I, I to can't. get that close to the finale and not quite make it, so. Dang, unless it was Butch there. <laughs> I didn't realize how Butch she looked in that part. The fashion queen, because as a little fat boy, you're not flipping through fashion magazines. Ow, catch the camera, catch the light. Ow. <laughs> I wish this hat on Heidi was bigger. It's just too small. <laughs> it needs to be like a, a really big brim. They all said you. <laughs> Did they really? Nature is the shadiest dumb boots. Oh. I mean, we all know that. <laughs> I'm so thrilled that I got to see my season nine sister, James Mansfield. He is. Well, when James called me, she didn't sound that thrilled to see you. Oh, she, oh, she said not to say that out loud. I can edit this part out. Okay, I didn't see Candy's whole outfit. I do like this. I'm going to buy that outfit. It's time to have a Latina. I Every season. It's time to have a Latina. It's time to have a big girl. <laughs> 30 years later. <laughs> Getting it. The other girls better watch out. 
I'll tell you, Candy is wearing the whole palette of blush these days. <laughs> Get ready for a good time. This is gonna be thick now. Somebody say, isn't that all the girls that we heard rumors about? Yes, it is. <laughs> well, what do you guys think out there in YouTube land? I am kind of excited about this season for most of the girls. You know, some some I'm like, eh. But, you know, I, I think because it just brings back memories. Like, this is like even more memories than what All-Star 6 had. I just hope that production doesn't mess it up. Seriously. I really hope not. But congrats to all the girls. All the girls, including the ones who I may not care for that much. All of them. Um... It's y'all's time to shine again and get hate mail from the fans. <laughs> Congratulations to James, now Trixie's best friend. Girl, don't think you're too big to stop making me wigs, girl. Okay, you know I'm booked. You know I'm booked once a red moon. So don't try it, girl. Anyway. <laughs> You guys let me know down below who y'all are rooting for, and we will talk soon. See you guys for the premiere oh, uh, uh, of All Stars 8 on May 12th. And I might do a Bad Boys Texas Raw View. Ugh, we'll see. Anyway, stay beat, stay beautiful, but most importantly, stay blessed. Kima Cho or Kamochi. Bye. Tommy doesn't touch my dirty pillows at prom. Or at least that's what Mama calls them. They're all, they're all, they're all gonna laugh at you. I was also so white and confused at school today. And I still don't know where the manager is. <laughs> all the girls laughed at me. They're all gonna laugh at you! Why? Harry White, get down here and praise God. Coming, Mama. And where's Boo Boo? Why? Why?